Yeah, Penn State came out really hot. Ohio State coming off a bye weekend the last season, or the last week in the regular season uh, for Big Ten play. So Penn State came out hot, and, and Buckeyes found a way to get a 3-0. Now got the first win there. You saw Trelor dump it in immediately off the opening faceoff. He sends it up the near side wall there. Puck goes back to Dobesh. Buckeyes chasing the puck, shot in from the near side. Goes wide of Dobesh, another one goes off his pad. Ohio State in transition, now it's Quinn Preston. Another shot goes north of the crossbar. Good defensive play from the Nittany Lions. Xander Lampa, puck skates right past Dobash. he's there to beat the, the wraparound to the near wall, two wall. At the point now, Penn State shot in, left flipper pad save from Dobesh. Another save from Jakob Dobesh. He had 49 last night on 52 shots in the Buckeyes' 4-3 win. Another one gets through, but blocker save from Dobesh. Back to the near side, exits the zone. Buckeyes trying to deny the Nittany Lions here. Another shot goes off the chest and back behind Dobesh. Another one sent in. Dobesh tries to cover it. He's out of position. Job by the uh, the fourth line of the Penn State Nittany Lions getting the puck in, working the forecheck here. And, and as you mentioned, Dobesh kind of. Puck back to the neutral zone. Sent in, picked up by the Nittany Lions. Penn State from the slot, gobbled up by Jakob Dobesh. Guys on defense in their own end. Sent up to the neutral zone, it's Cherimetta. Sends one in and it's an easy save for Liam Sulian. And then Ohio State was able to find their footing and, and similar theme so far tonight from Penn State to start. Kerwin shot deflected. Now into the attacking zone come the Buckeyes. Westland sends it wide. And nothing too outside the parameters of the game. Hockey, a physical sport, sometimes tensions flare. Shot off the rebound, no good. Dumped back around behind the goal to Trelor. Takes it left to right, back to McWard at the point. We're gonna get a whistle after some contact in the corner. You know, have met each other several times before tonight. 38th meeting all time. Ohio State won last night four to three in game one of this postseason series. Shot fired in from the near side, save from Dobish. The last time these two teams met before last night, Jakob Dobesh set a career high 51 saves. More than happy to try to set that again. Ohio State, Ohio State back to even strength here. Two penalty kills in the first period against Penn State. McWard up the near side now. Sends it to the far side. Shot off the left pad. And that's what you gotta, when things aren't going right, maybe you don't have a lot of shots on goal, you don't have to think about getting the puck on the net, you gotta think about get it into the corners and, and start to wear down the, uh, the op opposition's defenseman. Shot sent in from Gildon, couldn't get through. Berger went to Wall, now back to Berger. Off the defensive stick from Jake Wise. Another shot, routine glove save. Pretty much every time. Save from Dobesh. Dowd corrals it back at the Nittany Lion end. Now McMenamin. Guiding up the sheet. He got it to Berger, and there's the score. Penn State opens the night on offense. 1-0 Nittany Lions. Mm. Able to cash in on what was a really good period, as you see. Looks like puck bounces around a little bit. McMenamin finds Lugris walking down the slot and just. Now behind the net. Final seconds. And there's the horn. We head to intermission number one, Penn State. This is our host team here at the fourth seed going up against the fifth seed, Nittany Lions. Alongside Brandon Kearney, I'm Caleb Spinner here on Big Ten Network Plus. Entertaining first period. 
as if they were hosting at Pagula Ice Arena in State College, Pennsylvania. As it is, Ohio State finished at that four seed. They will host. Here comes Sad Locha. Lost the handle. Dunlap, glove save from Sulian. And denying Dunlap to his game tying attempt. Another shot immediately sending off the face off, deflected. Merkelov bringing it in. Had two goals last night against Penn State in the Ohio State victory. Shot off the right flipper pad of Liam Sulier to the near side. Penn State moving it up right to left and into the glove of Jakob Dobish. Puck on his stick, sends it around to a teammate on the far side. It was Wise who had it, was shoved in the back, lost it. Ohio State wanted a checking from behind call. They didn't get it. Egregious enough for a penalty, but certainly could have gone either way. Certainly momentum, something you have to keep in the fact that one player run into the other. Said Locha had a shot inside. Looked like he redirected it just enough. Puck on his stick goes around behind Dobish. Battling with Marooney. Shot. Sent in from only a few feet away. Dobesh makes the save. Guzzo looking to break out for the Buckeyes. Along the far slide to the slot. Pulls back. Gabriel sent one in. Off the rebound. Tried to get the deflection. Did Cherimetta. Denied by Sulier with the Buckeyes. Hitting the zone and entering the Ohio State end. Is Copeland who fans on the shot. Up the near side to Westland. Bluff save from Sulier. Against the Wisconsin team, I don't think many people expected to put up a fight. Chess save from Jakob Dobesh. Most likely a battle, a rematch against number two Michigan. Certainly any of those matchups would be prime time ones. You'd love to see them. Grateful for Wisconsin if they're able to take down the Irish and save them from playing Minnesota. Assuming Ohio State is able to repeat the outcome from last night and move on to the Big Ten semifinal. And to kind of get him open, the, uh, the inside winger set a pick on the Ohio State Buckeye. Ref called that second interference call we've had so far tonight. Gabriel immediately sends in a shot from the far side. Lost it. Here comes Penn State. Two on one with two white sweaters trailing. Save from Dobesh. Had to reach behind him to make sure that that puck wouldn't skate across the goal line. Under his arm, as you see right here, Penn State captain the Naples letting one go and Dobish checking around. And, and Back to Rydell at the point. Shot sent in, tried to get the redirect from Gildon at the goal line. Back out to the point with Rydell. Another shot off the post, rebound, score! Michael Gilden evens it up 1 1. Finally breaks through, big shot, kind of a fumble. Wasn't the best, prettiest looking power play for the, the majority of that two minute span. And puck goes all the way around, finds itself up to the point. Shot, finds itself off the post, strum in front, Michael Gildon. Right on the spot, fires at five hole, beats Soulier to tie this one up. One. And as you mentioned, had a big year last year and, and got off to a little bit of slower start this year. Maybe one of those sophomore slumps, but certainly coming into his stride late in the season when you need him most. For the Buckeyes, Mack able to get a stick on it. Here come the Nittany Lions, Ben Schoen. A goal for Penn State. Snuck right past Dobesh, and the Nittany Lions take the lead again. Great offense coming up the ice of Penn State Nittany Lions. I think it was going to be Ryan Kerwin right there on the goal line, throws one towards the net. The athletic band. Another shot, another save for Dobesh. Flipped in. Almost a go ahead goal for Penn State. For that, we'll see if we get a look. I think the puck actually. Popped up and sat on his jersey for a second right there. Ohio State controlling in their own end. McWard sends it ahead to Jake Wise. 
on the near side. Shot sent in, blocker save from Sulier. And we'll get a whistle to stop the play. Gabriel playing behind. Something we haven't even mentioned today. Mason Lorai still out of action with a knee. There was the tying shot, went wide of the net. At the far side, now back to the slot from the goal line. Into the goal, shot deflected, save from Soulier in the official crease. Gratton had it, lost it. Buckeyes, 2-1. And there's the horn to end the second frame. For these two teams, it really depends now on that Wisconsin-Notre Dame series, depending on the winner of that, will depend, will determine where these one of these two teams travels to next year, next weekend, Ann Arbor or Minneapolis. Gilden on the far side, he had a goal, Ohio State's lone goal. In the crease, Gilden had another look, sealed up quickly by the pads of Sulier. Comes away with possession. Almost a great look to Merkulov, who had two goals last night for the Buckeyes. Shot sent in, pad save. Another save. Risky rebound. Buckeyes able to keep it in to Westlin. His centering pass couldn't get through the defense of DeNaples. Buckeyes get it again. A shot off the pad save from Sulier. Now down the near side. Penn State in transition. From the slot, shot ripped in on Dobesh, equal to the task. Out of the 52 shots he faced, he's got 32 on 34 shots tonight. O'Connell rips one in, goes wide of the glove hand. Got a few new skaters out on the ice. Regula sends it in, gobbled up by Soulier. Up ahead to the Nittany Lions, it's McEacher. Lost it in front of the crease. Loose puck now, Penn State corrals it. Shot ripped in, Dobesh deflects. Buckeyes down 10 in the shot department, 37-27. A win for Ohio State means a trip to the semifinal, a win for the Nittany Lions. Penn State leading Ohio State 2-1. McWard on the near side, dumps it into Sheremetta. Ahead to Guzzo, who had it, wrapped around. And it appears Sulier made the save, and indeed he did. As you look here, Patrick Guzzo gets the puck from Mark Chirimetta, doing some good work down low, really making the Penn State Nittany Lions defense work. Westland had it, tried to get it back to Singleton and lost it. Ben Schoen up the ice to Kerwin. Routine glove save for Jakob Dobesch. An opportunity for this, you, you lose 4-0, you're probably a little more down in the dumps, but they showed some fight and really carried a good amount of the pace last night in the third, which probably gave them some momentum coming into the Saturday night rematch. There's a goal! Right off the rip, speaking of momentum, Ohio State opens it up at twos. From the point, if you see this one come in, I know Tate Singleton was kind of in front of the net, I don't think he tipped it. Yeah, looks like Soulier just kind of... Now pursuing it is Kevin Wall. The future Carolina Hurricane. Now frees it up for Marooney. Shot in, goes up off the chest of Dobesh. It was more just to keep Soulier on his toes. Didn't have much of an angle to shoot that. You see that replay, great save. Great look from Kevin Wall. Just sent it further in on Dobesh than he wanted. Gilden sends another one in, glove save. Added at the point, then lost it to the Buckeyes. Gustav Westland, full head of steam to Trelor on the near side. Stick save from Soulier. Puck bounced right back to his left side. And Berger will pick it up. That's very recent. The offensive zone team gets to choose which side they take the face off on now after an icing. Shot off the glass, McWard. Who had the tying goal for the Buckeyes, had a shot sent in there. Still tied up. Now Penn State came away with it. Dobesh there to make the save. As the shot was taken in within a foot of his crease. In college hockey, seven teams, you get to know each other really well and, and they're all true blue blood programs uh, across this country, so the games. As he was pushed into the glass by Adam Pillowitz. 
Maroney had it. And it looks like we're going to get a penalty here for a slash. Played really tough, played with an edge, but you just get that stick right up on the hands of Joey Maroney, kind of a little can opener. Will kill the power play. For Ohio State, one of three on power play chances. The Nittany Lions have killed the other two. Shot goal! Penn State goes ahead, 3-2 off Ryan Kerwin. Ryan Kerwin certainly having a big game tonight for the Nittany Lions assist. You see right here, yeah, number five Berger is going to kind of put guilt, guilt on on his back hip, takes a puck to the net. So now they're going to review this for interference. Dobesh wasn't able to exit the game comfortably. Had to remain in there until about a minute and a half left. Dobesh halfway through the zone, and here he comes in favor of an extra attacker for Ohio State. Gets over to the bench. Quinn Preston getting in on the forward check, trying to create some late offense here. And yeah, Cam Thiesing over to Jake Wise. What a save. The Buckeyes, an empty net here. Puck sent up. Inches away from the empty net dagger. Gabriel to Merkulov. Merkulov trying to get it to Thiesing. Gabriel sends another in. And a glove save with two seconds. The clock late to stop, so we'll get a review to determine the time remaining. But the clearing attempt goes to Gabriel, who's able to get a slap shot. Ohio State, their final opportunity to force overtime. Kick it through. Penn State holds on.